Howdy. For someone uh, my age, I do something that's a little bit unusual. Usually find it in younger people. It has to do with my earlier profession. Instead of uh, getting my news from the television or radio or broadcast media, I tend to get my news from apps on my phone. Now, because of the, uh, let's just say, unreliability of the mainstream media, I have a variety of apps. I have about a dozen of them. And they range from left-leaning to right-leaning and about half of them are outside the United States, Australia, England, places like that. Gives me a broader perspective. Now I try to check all of them to try to get the uh, range of perspectives. Uh, uh, I figure that by che if I check enough of them and compare the differences they have, I might get somewhere close to the truth. But even so, I do find myself sometimes wanting to check one more than the other, believe one more than the other, because I find it comforting. Paul warns Timothy that people will turn from sound teaching and search for teachers that uh, satisfy their itching ears. I must admit that I am not exempt from that temptation. Now, we might say, well, these news media sources, we're talking about the world around us, and they're not necessarily about spiritual matters, but we are immersed in this world, and our lives are not as compartmentalized as sometimes we would like them to be. Jesus says that, uh, that Satan speaks lies, it's his native tongue. And the way we live our lives outside the church affects our spiritual lives inside the church. Our commitment must always be to truth. Our commitment must always be to sound teaching, whether it has to do with the, the things divine or the things secular. It's about the character of who we are and if we are going to be true disciples, if we are going to be perfect, even as our Heavenly Father is perfect, then all aspects of our lives must be dedicated to the principles of God, of truth, of love, of compassion, and of righteousness. So, even though it's difficult to wade through the muck and mire of all the different slants and opinions and spins and twists that we hear through all our information sources. Our commitment is always to truth, since all truth comes from God. Thanks for listening. Adios.